there's this new feature in CapCut called the Brand Kit. This is just recently launched, and if you go into your app settings on your phone and check your version of your app, you may want to upgrade your app from the App Store to get on the latest version. The Brand Kit is being released in the version 9.7.1, so go ahead and upgrade your phone so you get on this. I'll show you how it works, but it's a really helpful tool in order to save a lot of files that you often use throughout your projects and you can import them into your projects easily and have them stored for you at any time. Now open up your app from your phone. Now you're gonna click on the cloud icon to access your cloud storage. At the top, you're gonna see brand kit. Go ahead and click on brand kit. If you see this, just click okay. Now you're inside your brand kit. This is where you're gonna store anything that you use regularly. This can be images, videos, fonts, music, backgrounds, anything that you regularly pick within your projects, you can save here to access them quicker. If you wanna add something to the brand kit here, you would just click on the gray icon that has a plus sign next to it. Now let's add something from your brand kit into your project. So go back to your home screen and open up a project or start a new one. At the end of this project here, I'm gonna click the plus sign and at the top, you can see your space, which is CapCut Ninja for me. I'm gonna click on CapCut Ninja and then I can see my brand videos and my brand images from here that I can pull in quickly. Now I'm gonna show you how to use the brand kit within the CapCut application on your PC. With the CapCut application open, go to the homepage and Open up your space. If you have a space set up, go ahead and click on the space. And from here, you're gonna see a tab here that says Brand Kit. Click on Brand Kit, and this is where all of your files will be living. So you can easily scroll down to see everything, and if you wanted to add an image or a video to your Brand Kit, you can do that easily by clicking here. Now, full disclosure, this brand kit option is available to everyone for free now. But by the way CapCut is branding this, it sort of sounds like it's a trial period for the brand kit. So I'm not sure if in the future this is going to be a premium pro feature only, but for the time being, it is free. Now I'm gonna go into a project on my computer and show you how to insert something into the brand to insert something from your brand kit into a project. So I have a project open here, and from the left-hand side here, you can see that you have your brand assets here. Cancel this whole clip. Now I'm gonna go into a project and show you how to add something from your brand kit into your project from PC. So with my project open, you can see the brand assets tab here on the main panel. I'm going to open that up and from right here, you can see all of your brand assets. So anything that you use regularly, you can save here. Videos and images will show. And so you can easily enter your introductions or your transitions that you like to use throughout all of your videos in one place. It's very helpful.